Hi you all. Today we're going to make some super stretchy slime. For this batch of slime you'll need some Elmer School glue, some baking soda, laundry tide, contact solution, and shaving cream. Let's go ahead and get started. So to start out with, you'll need some glue. And there's no really certain amounts for this, but you could do like a cup or something, or you could even do a gallon. So I'm just gonna pour it in my bowl. I'm making a medium-sized batch. But like I said, you can make like a gallon or something. <laughs> And so now I'm gonna add some Tide. So I'm just gonna put it into this blue measuring thing, uh, my Bob. And I'm gonna pour it in to where the glue was. And you don't need so much, otherwise it's gonna be super watery. So yeah, then contact solution and you could do like a spoonful of this like you can take your spoon and have like a half a spoonful but like I said there's really no certain measurements I think this said third time I said that I don't know so then for shaving cream you don't want you don't want a little bit but you don't want a lot just at least that much then you're gonna need some baking soda. So, you may have seen in my previous video, Moon Sand, I made a tiny batch with baking soda. You need at least half a spoon, a little bit, not too much. And then you'll um, stir to mix. And it should form really fast. So just keep stirring. And if it's really watery, that might just be too much tie. Now I'm just gonna roll up my sleeves and pick up the slime. I'm gonna, it's a little bit sticky. So I'm gonna add some more contact solution. Whoa. Just a little bit. Stir to mix that in. Just gonna pick it up and toss it around in my hands. Probably once after you've mixed all your ingredients and you'll have to at least add a little bit more contact solution. You can add food dye, but I'm not like, gonna add food dye because I don't have it at reach right now. So yeah, that's how you make your stretchy slime. I hope you enjoyed and please subscribe. Bye.